Hello game fans and welcome to another review from Gaming Debugged. Planet Coaster is an extensive construction and management simulation game by Frontier Developments, now available on Xbox. Players can design and build their dream theme park, manage the entire infrastructure and grow their career as a park director. But is Planet Coaster a thrilling ride or a tiresome never-ending queue? Here's my review of Planet Coaster. Having grown up with Bullfrog's theme park and Roller Coaster Tycoon, I am no stranger to the theme park sim. However, the limitations of the time and sometimes by the platform meant that the creations were rudimentary, especially by Planet Coaster standards. As such, the first thing you'll notice when playing Planet Coaster is that it is truly massive. Planet Coaster has a veritable buffet of park customization options, allowing for an unprecedented level of creativity. Time poor players can use the wealth of standard rides or download the myriad creations available from the community. Whereas those who have the time and inclination will marvel at the immense level of details that budding park designers can go to to create their most perfect park. To introduce the new console system, the console edition has a handy tutorial that is fully voiced and gives those new to the theme park building genre a gentle introduction to the various tools and options. Is everything about cold hard cash with you, Cynthia? No, I also like stocks and shares. Even if you are used to park sims, the tutorials are worth working through as they are both amusing and helpful. The button mapping is hard to understand at first but after your first hour or so, they make absolute perfect sense. Frontier have done a magnificent job of making every option just a couple of clicks away. For those who struggle to get on board with the new control systems, then the keyboard and mouse support is there if you need it. Outside the ride creation, players also need to manage the park as a whole from placing bins, adding food outlets, employing staff and increasing ticket prices. There is so much for you to get stuck into it can be a little bit overwhelming at first. The level of customization is awe-inspiring and make this the biggest, most ambitious theme park sim to date. However, having so much detail in some areas do highlight a couple of small failings elsewhere. The business management side of the game is much less detailed than the park creation side. For me, this was fine, as the well-being and salary level of the dinosaur mascot is not a fun part of the job for me. But for those, who are looking for a more realistic experience of park management, there might be a few who would, would like to see more detail on this side of the game. Similarly, it's not a big deal, but you soon notice that character models are reused for the maintenance man and other key workers. Whilst this does help you identify them quickly, the sheer variation in guest models makes seeing the same person over and over again in different parts of the park a little bit jarring. It would have been nice to have more unique staff as you are expected to care about them throughout the game. The vibrant cartoon style graphics are beautiful and the randomised behaviour of the guests give the park a life of its own. The ambient sounds of chatter, screams and music all add to the atmosphere, drawing you into that ever so important first person mode where you can see the park at ground level and try out the multitude of rides. Overall, Planet Coaster is a giant behemoth of a game with a mind-boggling number of customization options. Whether you're playing through the challenge scenarios, creating new parks from the ground up, or just enjoying the plethora of community-created rides and parks, you will never be short of things to do. The new console control system is highly intuitive and becomes second nature very quickly. Players that are new to the genre may be overwhelmed at first, but the more you get into it, the more you get out of it. A truly phenomenal park sim that is well worth the entry fee. If this review has been useful, then please give it a like, a thumbs up, Subscribe to the channel and I'll be back with another review very soon. Finish him.